Good Sunday morning. It is 515. We have an early warning weather alert because uh, today and into tonight and tomorrow morning, uh, we're going to have precipitation moving in and some of that is going to be in the form of more than just rain uh, and that's why we have this early warning weather alert and it's especially tonight and into tomorrow morning uh, when colder air is filtering in and temperatures get pretty close to freezing or just below um, that some of what's wet may refreeze and cause some patches of ice or black ice and there's also probably going to be a time here where what will be mainly rain today changes over to snow and that will also uh, perhaps coat some of the ground with a little bit of white. And that's also gonna create a little bit of travel woe too. So uh, it's a minor situation. It's not a huge, huge blockbuster deal, uh, but it's enough that tomorrow morning, if you have to rush out the door, this might cause you a little bit of inconvenience. So we just wanna let you know that there might be a little bit of trouble in some areas tomorrow morning as a result of that. A notice though by afternoon on Monday, temperatures will go into the lower and middle 40s. So uh, there will be some melting of all of that fairly quickly during the day, uh, and then it's done. Uh, but then an Arctic front moves through, and then what happens is, is it turns colder for Tuesday. We expect highs only to be in the 30s. Wednesday, the sun will be strong. Temperatures will go into the lower half of the 40s. It turns breezy on Thursday as the wind aloft switches direction, and that brings in milder air. For Thursday, temperatures will be topping off in the upper 40s to near 50. And then Friday looks rather wet as another system comes in and really pulls in a lot of moisture. We could have some heavy downpours on Friday. A pretty vigorous storm actually is going to be in the works then. Um, and then once that sweeps on out, it turns windy on the backside of that, and there could be some wet snowflakes at the tail end of that one too. Um, when we take a look at the satellite and the radar, you can see that we've got rain moving into the state. Notice what's happening, at least according to the algorithm. When this hits some of that air that's a little bit farther inland, that's drier and slightly colder, we're seeing that switch over to some form of an icy mix. It could be some sleet pellets or wet snowflakes mixing in. So we do expect to see, uh, in especially some of the higher elevations, some of that mix over for a little while. But the warm air shall win out. And so as the precipitation continues to come in, at least today, we are expecting to see mainly rain. And that's what you're going to see with a future cast tomorrow's weather today. Any hint of mixed precipitation will go away by noon across northwestern Connecticut. And a lot of us will probably just have a start on this thing as rain. And then you see just through the afternoon periods of rain, there could be some heavier downpours rolling through the area. Uh, as you see here, here's some suggested at 6 p.m. And it's still just plain rain at 9, even at midnight it's so. But then once we get into the wee hours of the morning after midnight, that's when we see the switch over to snow again, especially in the higher elevations. We could pick up a quick coating to an inch or two with that. And also, of course, there's then the refreeze considerations of tomorrow in the morning for black ice. By noon time, all of that precipitation's gone, and in the afternoon, it's just partly sunny, breezy, and it's going to be, relatively speaking, reasonable with the temperatures. Uh, here's what some of the future casts are saying in terms of accumulations with some of the snow, uh, especially tonight and into tomorrow morning. That's the NAM. Here is the European. Uh, so it gives you an idea that we're looking at just basically a coating of snow uh, on the ground uh, in many areas anywhere, especially from the Hartford area north. So today, though, it looks like it's just plain rain. Um, we are expecting to see uh, temperatures today in the upper 30s inland. And you can see along the shoreline, we'll see temperatures pretty close to 40 or 41. So kind of a cold rain at that.